Okay guys, so today I have another PC accessory that I want to share with you guys and by the look of this shape, this is definitely a keyboard and for your information as well, the brand that this accessory comes from not really into all these PC gaming kind of accessories but they do release one so if you guys want to know what is the brand that I'm talking about watch this video till the end so as usual, grab your drinks, grab your snacks Let's go! Hello guys, welcome back to Hate Sphere YouTube channel. My name is Fear, and you guys are watching Tech and Trend. So guys, as usual, to those who are watching this video that haven't yet subscribed to Hate Sphere YouTube channel, what are you guys waiting for? Please do consider subscribing to us as we release tech related content. Especially if you guys are into setup series, unboxing series and also review series, then this is the right channel for you guys. Also one more thing I want to add before I go on with the unboxing today is that if you guys actually realize that this video have a different colorway compared to those videos that I've released before, this is because Bopi Production have already upgraded a new camera. Yeah, we try to shoot with S-Log and all that kind of thing. So. Excuse for some difference between this video and also the other videos that I've already released on this channel. Okay guys, so as I've mentioned in the beginning of the video just now, this is actually a PC accessory or gadget, whatever you guys want to call it. And to be really honest guys, when I first heard that this brand actually comes out with this product, I am actually quite surprised that that particular brand actually released you know, PCs, peripherals or even uh, gaming peripherals. So I'm quite curious about the quality and about the looks and everything. So without wasting any time, let's unbox this. Okay. Ta-da! Okay guys, so what I have over here is actually Philips G294 gaming keyboard. What? Philips? Really? So yes guys, if you guys actually didn't know, the brand Philips, the brand that usually famous with home appliances like aircons, fridge, and then there is a microwave or even oven. Usually Philips are associated with those kind of products. I, I've never heard about Philips releasing any PC peripherals or even gaming's gadget, if you know what I'm saying. But here I am with one of the products that they have. Yeah, so that's the box over there. The box actually looks very Philips, you know, with all this hue kind of thingy and then the logo over there. So I'm just going to show you guys how the box actually looks like. So yeah, that is what the box looks like with the Philips logo over here. And then brighten up your gaming over there. And then there's the graphic of the keyboard. So based on the picture in front of you, it looks like the keyboard actually have some multi-color functions to, to the backlight. But I'm not sure either it's RGB or not. We will find out later about that. Okay, it also right over there, MB Glow, and then there is a stylish design and silent design, yeah. Okay, uh, excuse the box. Okay, the box actually came not really in a good condition. Okay, this is not because of the packaging. This is actually because it was raining just now. So usually the guy just left the, the things at the mailbox out there and it was raining, so too bad. At the back over here, just another... Uh, graphics of the keyboard itself and some multi-languages um, details over here and then down here just some other stuff the logo of Philips and then the, the barcode and stuff okay so let's open it up the moment of truth this is also actually my first time seeing one of these one two three so this is how the inside of the whole packaging looks like so we have some of the Philips people works over here, the product support and also some of the manuals over here and then warranty card, yeah. So we have that and then this is how the keyboard looks like. I'm just going to put the box down here and alright guys, okay, okay. Hmm. Okay guys, so that is how the keyboard of Philips G294 looks like. So the material of this keyboard is actually throughout all the way is plastic. So yeah, and then at the back over here also is actually 
um, another plastic panel yep nothing much and they have this you know leveler thingy to raise the keyboard basically that's that it's a normal 107 keys throughout the keyboard and the cable that they use is just a normal um, USB cable it's not a braided type of cable and also a normal USB plate okay it's not a gold plated USB but it's fine it's fine okay so let me try the switch first huh Okay. okay, so this is definitely uh, not a membrane keyboard based on the feel over here. Okay, so based on the um, typing experience of this Philips G294 gaming keyboard, it have the same feeling as the HP k 300s keyboard that I have last time. So I assume that this is kind of like a semi-membrane kind of switch. It have a rubber dome under this. But the difference is this keyboard is actually really quiet. Okay, if you guys can hear the, the typing test. Yeah. This is actually really really quiet and I've already like pressing on the switch really loud and hard but not so loud so I guess it really do stands up to the one of the marketing point of this keyboard which is a silent design. Based on my first impression I think this keyboard looks really really clean. Mm, it doesn't feel cheap de definitely but it's it is nothing like mechanical keyboard at all unlike the HP K300. It definitely doesn't have any mechanical keyboard aesthetic to it. It just really looks like a normal keyboard to be really honest. And if you look closely actually at the keycap, I'm not sure you guys can see at the B camera over there but if you guys can actually look closely at the keycap over there, you actually have this kind of like, you know, two-tone kind of keycap, what, what usually people call it a pudding type of keycap, usually on mechanical keyboard. You know those keycap that have two layers of colors in it usually like the bottom one is transparent and then only the top one is like black color or white color okay so without wasting any time i'm going to test this now with my thunder snow gaming pc over here and then i'm going to also explain how the lighting works and i'm gonna try to play apex on this keyboard let's go okay guys so i already set up this philips g294 gaming keyboard on my thunder snow gaming pc so basically you guys just plug and play no softwares or whatever it is needed just plug and you guys good to go and if you guys can see here the lighting is actually really bright guys yeah it's really really bright and this is with uh lighting blasting from the behind of this camera let's say i turn off my lights over here yep this definitely looks better in dark situation or dark room you know this actually look really really nice guys yep you guys can see the switches over there yeah this is actually really, really nice okay and you guys can see over here as well the color actually from greens over here and then there's blue and then there's a red over here and then some purple or kind of magenta thing we have over here and based on what i know that this keyboard only have this one settings of color there's no motion to it there's no color selection to it just this one color you know static and all you guys can do with this one is just actually turn off the color by pressing this key over here yeah so basically you guys just turn that off and then you press that back it turns back on like I've mentioned just now, even with the lighting behind of me right now really really bright, it's actually really showcase itself really really well. So, good job Philips! So where you guys can actually get your hand on one of these Philips K294 gaming keyboard, you guys can actually go to the official Shopee mall at philipsaccessories.os. So as you guys can see at my screen recording over here, this keyboard actually retails for only RM49.80. Yes, meaning this keyboard is actually under 50 ringgit Malaysia, which is really, really perfect and suitable for all those budget gamers out there. And also based on the advertisement over here, it stated that this keyboard actually use fully RGB backlit keys for enhanced visibility and gaming experience. Okay, to me when it comes to RGB, usually the keyboard should come with all the customizable features. But then again, this keyboard don't really have any customizable features uh, in terms of the lighting. So. Um, not really RGB, but the color, yes, does represent a little bit of RGB, but I'm gonna call it a uh, multi-color. It also have a low-profile chiclet keys for faster typing, response, and quiet operation. Yes, that's the name, guys, chiclet keys. This kind of um, key type is actually called chiclet. Chiclet, chiclet, 
chiclet but yeah guys that's about it so other than that also uh, this keyboard have one year warranty so don't worry anything happen to the keyboard within one year you can actually claim the warranty with the warranty card given by Philips and last thing that I wanted to mention over here that it have softer quiet and more accurate island style chiclet keys yes so the the key cap over here is actually so called island type I don't even know what that means but yeah that one the silent type is actually yep it is really really a silent switch to be really really honest but yes guys that's about it at the moment as you guys can see on the screen recording over here uh, it stated that it sold out on Shopee so I guess maybe you guys need to wait around another week maybe it will be available if you guys like it maybe you can just add to your wish list and Shopee will notify you whenever the product is finally in stock don't worry I'll be leaving the link to this product in the description box down below if you guys are interested to get one of these Philips G294 gaming keyboard yes just one more thing that I want to point out a little bit of confusion over here if you guys actually look at the box it's stated over there G294 yeah if you guys can see over there but based on the advertisement over here it wrote that it's actually K294 but if you go to the manual it's actually stated that it's actually Philips SPK8294 so I don't even know which one is the right one I guess what's stated on the box is the right one G294 so we're just gonna go with Philips G294 so what are my final conclusions about this Philips G294 gaming keyboard okay first of all this keyboard definitely had the looks okay the the lighting is actually really bright even on a very you know when you don't turn off your your room slam or whatever it is the multicolor lighting actually really stands out it does actually give a really good look to it based on gaming aesthetic wise if you guys wanna uh, consider that but in terms of the feeling of course this is not mechanical so this is not the best typing experience when it comes to pressing the the switch and the keys but Overall, I think not bad and if you guys are not really the one that like all those mechanical keyboard sound, this will be really good for you guys because this is definitely a very silent type of switch. Other than that, build quality to me actually really nice, quite sturdy. It doesn't really look cheap despite of the price that actually less than RM50 ringgit. And I think as a final words to this Philips G294 gaming keyboard is as per I mentioned just now, if you guys are a budget gamer and uh, you guys don't really like mechanical switch type, you know it's too loud or the kind of things and you want all those lighting kind of thingy while you guys are playing game or do work, then this will be one of the best option for you guys. And this is less than 50 ringgit guys. So something that you guys really need to consider. Okay guys, so what do you guys think about this Philips G294 gaming keyboard? If you guys have any thoughts or opinion regarding this keyboard, please do leave it on the comment section down below. I really want to know. If you guys want to buy one of these, go to the description box down below where I'll be leaving the Shopee links of this Philips G294 gaming keyboard. That's about it for this week's episode of Tech and Trend. I'll see you guys in the next video definitely. And like I have always said guys, remember to always do great, be great, and stay great. Hate sphere. Walking off. Chiclet. Kiss. Chiclet. <laughs>